right hey everybody welcome to marvelous gap we are playing immortals phoenix rising um i know it's been a minute since i have logged on to this game you wouldn't believe it but the reality the reality is i like the game it's just the um the, pu the puzzles man it's just way too many so um what i'm going to do is um <laughs> i'm going to play the main quest of this game so yeah i'm going to play the main quest of this game if it wasn't so many puzzles i swear i would more than likely like love this game 10 times more than what i you know it just it just takes away from the fun factor for me personally so we are doing aphrodite's quest i swear i don't even know what i'm doing but um i recorded so much and this game like everything's been going so well everything's been going so well with the other recordings that i get back to this game because i think three people requested this get back to this game and i've been having hella difficulties i played this before and the recording is messed up a lot literally i literally am so far i got like three gods in this game already but um the recording is just it's just always some kind of technical difficulty yep Sure is. And this is no different. Oh, you missed. Oh, my gosh. So, um, all my commentary from the. From what I thought was recording, yeah, I'm not. I don't repeat myself. Oh, you're not dead. You are now. Wow. Somebody's still alive. What are you? What are you? Just. Yeah, um, <laughs> who, who, who asked for this? I know it's one of my friends, but, ooh, wait. He's like taking five steps forward and 30 steps back. But anyway, I had to get that little frustration out to me one particular person know what I'm going through playing this game for you um, so what I did was I um, was told that one of my videos one of my recent videos was very low and the person couldn't hear us so what I did was What I did was I turned the game up so it's really loud in my ear. And I, oh man, crap. And I, um, so it makes me talk louder. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm still a little discombobulated from all of that recording I just did. Just go, it's just go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah so it's really loud in my ear which is making me talk louder so I hope it don't sound like I'm screaming or something from the sea foam Aphrodite rose full grown beautiful as that same pearl I can't take this anymore Zeus Gaia lied to you about how Aphrodite was born. Oh, yeah? Then tell me how it really happened. 
And Kronos... ...may fought. You can't be serious! ...fell into the sea. That's... ...because Kronos cut off his... You're sick, Prometheus! Do not talk to me! With the sea foam secure... Ah. ...Phoenix resolved to return to Aphrodite... ...with the key to her freedom... ...and the vault. You've returned, you sweet creature! Do you have the sea foam? Right here. Oh, aren't you good? Please, take my blessing for all your hard work. Now quick, pour the foam on my roots. The sooner I can move, the sooner I can expand my apple care. Did it work? Coming out of the foam, I was so <gasps> fabulous. No, there's too many cuddly creatures that need my help. It keeps me awake at night, just seeing their little beaks and bright eyes, and those noses, those quivering wet noses. <gasps> Thanks a lot. What just happened? Typhon must not like me. Though, I couldn't possibly imagine why. Whenever anyone defies him, he sends one of his raids. And that raid delegates responsibility, as raids tend to do, to shades. So the warrior that just appeared wasn't really Achilles? Goodness, no! The true Achilles is far more dashing. Oh, you're telling me. He's hiding in a lair nearby. Until he's defeated, his shades will reappear on this part of the island. Is there ever any good news? Well, the sea foam worked and uh, I'm able to move my roots. One of them was actually blocking Achilles' lair. I can't help but the other three raids, though Heracles, Atalanta, and Odysseus. Oh, you know what they say. Bad things come in fours. No one says that. No one says that! <laughs> Tough crowd. What about the root blocking your essence? It's just that some people I care about have been turned into stone, so I'm quite keen to... No. No. Uh, for some reason, that root is still firmly in place. Uh, thank you for your concern. But what matters is I can start delivering apples. Oh, 
all the animals will be fed in no time. Let's get to it. Thank you kindly for all your help. Many happy returns. But I... That was strange. I can't keep standing idly by. Sorry, I mean busily preparing anymore. You have to bring Aphrodite back to her beautiful snarky self before I go crazy. By the gods, where did you come from? Behind you? Does it matter? Don't worry about me. Focus on finding another way to shrivel that root. So what? Saltier, more mythical water? Action. Wait. What about Aphrodite's tears? Didn't she cry at the death of Adonis? They'd be salty and powerful. You really know your stories, kid. Her tears just might work. If you put them directly on the root, blocking off her essence. Now where did Typhon hide them? You should search the vaults of Tartarus nearby. There are three crystallized tears. All right, we have a plan then. Please hurry. Until Aphrodite is back to herself, who will I talk to about whatever this is that you're wearing? What's wrong with what I'm wearing? And he's gone. <laughs> <laughs> all right we finally finally passed the first part of the aphrodite quest thank you so much for watching recording this was oh it was beyond levels of of, of frustrations just to get this part recorded but i really appreciate you watching if you like the video please leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next video oh my goodness.